I was asked to summarize Dr. Honecker's debriefing for you. He was assigned to Palace Station, a Wayland yutani research facility on the surface of LV-895. The Palace Station team developed weapons from Xenomorph XX-121. In particular, they explored the effects of a mutagenic agent. Xenomorphs and other test subjects were loosed by a containment breach. The majority of the staff perished. Unclear. Small amounts were delivered by the company. The science team was not told its origin. They referred to it as pathogen. As biogenetics is not Dr. Honecker's specialty, he is unable to provide details. No, his degree is in archaeology. He claims he was lured here by the promise of access to alien artifacts. Pardon. To be clear, I refer to artifacts from a technologically advanced alien civilization, not xenomorphs. Given that humanity has never recorded conclusive evidence of a tool using alien civilization, Dr. Honecker was understandably intrigued. Dr. Honecker and some of his colleagues fled Pala Station in a shuttle. It launched on a pre-programmed course to Katanga. Unfortunately, two creatures stowed aboard. They killed one, and you met the other, the mutated xenomorph he called Monica. You are familiar with the xenomorph reproductive process? It was gestated within a woman named Monica. Dr. Honecker seems unwilling to discuss it further. There was discord between the science team and Wayland yutanis manager, Administrator Bellows. In particular, Mr. Bellows ordered the use of human convicts to breed xenomorphs. Dr. Honecker doubtless hoped we had taken his employers into custody to face charges. Should you wish to review, I will keep the information on file for you. You scan the man. It is curious these pop. Hey, if you happen to acquire one of those color changing. Ca okay, well, let's see what fell off the back of the power loader. Hey, if you happen to a- Okay. Regulations require me to state that the battalion fabricators may not be used to replicate any device and or system that has not been licensed for use by Colonial Marine Corps Logistics Command. And I definitely don't have an unmonitored fabricator built out of spare parts stash in a hold somewhere. Because that would be wrong. Almost like what Hanukkah had to say. Wayland Yutani ran Katanga like a fucking ant farm. 
used androids to bring up animals from the moon, left them on the refinery for the Xenos, took the eggs back down to the lab. There's a queen aboard Katanga, laying those eggs. SOP says, Phew, that's when you pull out a final insurance claim. We'll deal with Katanga later. Right now, Colonel Ship wants us down on LV-895. Hanukkah says some whaling yutani people disappeared before his group evac. Could be there's other survivors looking for rescue. You could get the details on the surface conditions from Lieutenant Ko. She'll be flying you and Herrera down. Busy. Shoo. Our landing zone's a couple of clicks from Pala Station, at the base of the mountains to the west. You won't need any special gear. The environment is close enough to Earth. There's native life, but you probably won't have to worry about it. The Xenos that Honaker's idiot employers let loose are a bigger threat. Just remember, Wayland managers tend to store profit margins and promotion tracks where their brains should be. If you run into any, watch your back. Yeah, I wish I could give you some extra. Yeah, damn right you're ready for another mission. Marines, we're heading down to LV-895. The Weyland yutani surface lab was overrun by Xenos, but there may be survivors. The closest shelter is the mountain caves to the west. You repel into the caverns for search and rescue. Sky Patrol ready on Kingston, sir. Initiate on my mark. Three, two, one, mark.
Check your fire. Remember, we're looking for friendlies. This isn't a cave. It's block construction. A company bunker, maybe. He's alive.
console up on the side. Check that for me. Workplace incident files. Missing crew... casualties? Sounds like they got drones loose in here. Marines. You from Pala Station? Yes, I'm Security Chief Cynthia Rodriguez. You're in danger here, Marines. Yeah, no kidding. We're here to rescue you. survivors.
Ammo case. Rearming. Need ammo? Canyon. What the hell is that? With the overhang, we couldn't see this on approach. Grabbing ammo. Cross that canyon. over here. Oh, you got their location locked? Can 
you drop munitions in the gap? Like to fly a missile up your left nostril, Herrera. Check this out. Fire team, Rodriguez is ahead. Let's figure out what we're getting into. 